Good evening, I'm Max Goldwasser. We're continuing our coverage tonight on the breaking news story we first brought you at 4 o'clock when we checked in with our Alec Nolan about an hour ago. He told us that uh, four structures for a total of six residences were threatened at the time by a fire in Southeast Bend, and Alec is still on scene right now. Alec, has anything changed since then? Yes, Max, as I mentioned, we're still out here on the 600 block Southeast Bend off Wilson Avenue. We just spoke with Battalion Chief Trish Connolly right before she left. She did give us the official cause. The home behind us right here over on the left, family was having a nice barbecue, getting ready for the weekend barbecue. Uh, the, it was a brisket, you know, charcoal kind of old school barbecue. The embers got out of control with a wind gust. Those then hit the house on the deck. And then, as we mentioned, six residential units were impacted by this four homes but two of them were duplexes so it's incredibly sad and unfortunate these families getting ready for the weekend and it really just turned into their worst nightmare thankfully everybody is safe everybody was able to escape uh, in time they also were able to grab their pets uh, one of the children behind us even had a pet lizard uh, and a dog as well so it's great to see that everybody was all hands on deck sun river fire and rescue redmond fire and rescue sisters uh, cloverdale you know, you name it, they were here. And uh, Red Cross has also shown up on the scene. They're going to provide support to these families. We've been told they might possibly put them up in a hotel, just somewhere to be right now and have shelter during this time. Uh, you know, we'll continue to, to try and understand everything, and you can check it out online if we have any updates. Uh, and we will definitely throw it back to you right now, Max. Thank you.